Okay, this is my redstone playground. Each thing that you see all the way over to there is a creation that has its own purpose. All purely invented by me. This is just, as it says, me messing around. Each block powers the next block. There's no power source that actually works to these things other than these blocks. So I wanted to see how long I could extend this. That's what I came up with. My uh, roundabout staircase. Fills itself in. And then you pull it back. This is a triple extension pistol. Yeah, triple horizontal. Pushes a block three blocks out. Requires a lot of knowledge on that one. Uh, double horizontal. That one's pretty simple. I use that one a lot. Double vertical. Over and up. It's a good floor trap door kind of thing. Drop them into a hole. Why am I not striking? I can't. <sighs> Over and down. Makes for a good ceiling entrance. This was just kind of me messing around with giant doors. up in layers oh, no. creeper, creeper, and to show you how it works from the other side. Another creeper, another creeper, another creeper, another creeper, another creeper, running away, running away, running away. I set it up to only do half so you could actually watch oh, man, it go. Oh, I'm poisoned, I'm poisoned. Shit. Part of that one is not working. I think it's just missing a block, but I won't worry about that for now. My porticolous gate. Probably the most complex thing I could possibly have invented. I had to look it up on YouTube. As you can see, that part doesn't like to work all the time. Just that one corner block. They can't swim, right? I have no idea. this thing. It's impressive, that's for sure. Oh yes, my combination lock. Combo lock. Cool. No. Creeper, creeper, so creeper, it won't work no matter what you do unless you have the right combo. This one I believe I used my birth date. So Yep. And if I were to use any other switches it won't do anything. It has to be Zero, five, two, and six. Where does rain ever end? Babe, I understand this will be an extraordinarily long video, but if you watch it all, I promise it's going to be pretty interesting. Let me see. I have to reset this somehow. That's right, like that. Okay, so you're just walking into a hallway, and a trap that shoots arrows at you. God, they added so much stuff. Only one way out. Oh, 
Oh, no, those are squids. Never mind, those are squids. Oh, God. Like, no, no spiders. No spiders, please. <laughs> I love this door design. I love my two by one hidden design. How do you run? It's been glitching since they updated. You just double tap. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, shit. You press the forward button in quick succession. Uh, what? Forward button in quick succession. I don't know how to do it on a computer, babe. Oh, Fire I'm ballistic? Just to end. Uh, That's better teabagging my body. This is my improved fire ballista. Remembering that I invented all this, it's pretty insane. So, all I gotta do is turn this into a pulse. And it can go for as long as there are arrows inside of it. This is like a castle wall gate door. Let your army in. Oh yay, there's the sunrise. My suffocation trap. I just need to get you alive until then. This is another one of my toys that just goes on forever. I just buried myself into it. Yeah, if you can <laughs> see if we can get a look inside. It's just pushing that sand cube around, back and forth, powering each piston under it from the torch underneath. And it's been powered by this repeater system. This was a failed design. Uh, the extendable staircase. This is my first attempt at a hidden room. And I did it in class so you could see why it's kind of cool. It expands out to a, a much larger room. Think of a TARDIS style. I, have, I was trying to design a TARDIS. It closes back up into a hallway. The reason it's glass is so you can see the working. So as you go along, you see this is the delay to close it, that's the power to keep it open, and when that delay hits, it's closed. So I think I've been all the way over here. I can't even remember what this was. Some kind of hidden staircase design? Yeah, pushes the stairs over. Another version of my toy. This is to create like a moving landscape. You can actually make a building that will move that way. What was this? A tea door? Yeah. Different succession. The startings of my uh, moving maze. I have a much larger one that I'll show you shortly. Much. Larger. I can't even remember what I was doing over here. It's been way too long since I flooded. But just a kind of idea of what this maze was like. You get trapped in. You have no choice but to go sideways. You go sideways. You can't go backwards. Okay, well I can at least go back this way again. Nope, you get closed in from all sides again. It forces you to progress forward through the maze regardless. Traps you. Okay, if I remember it, this is a trick. Yeah. Voila. Through the maze. But that's the simple one. He saw this and decided he wanted to pay me to make a bigger one using a lot of these creations. But yeah, that is my Redstone Playground. Um, 
this, as you can see, is a super huge map that I've designed, and it connects to a little village over there. Here's a little mini side village, and I went through my map and found every village in this area, so I created a railroad track to keep up. This takes you to the next village over. Yes, I created this too. Naturally. I never had any help on these either. All of this is made by me. Super extensive long runway. So, yeah. This is my house. said I fenced in the entire area. The whole perimeter. The original building is fenced. And I added this because it's up in the air so nothing can get up there. Unless it spawns. There is one problem with this design and that is being that it is so big stuff spawns inside the fence. Brilliant. Either way. Pretty ridiculous. I loved that design on that building. Now that tower came out. Although my friends decided to point out to me that it is essentially a David Star. They caught me on that one. I'm not mistaken, this is the highest point in the game. Yeah. Can't build any further than this, even with their latest add-ons. And if you played a while back, the latest you'd probably remember is playing to the cloud level. So. Took forever to build a tower that big. I'm pretty sure...